Hello sweeties. Let's play. Let's get messy and have some fun and go on an adventure. Are you in? Grab your coffee. You're gonna need it. Hello sweeties. Okay, today it's still early in the morning. It's rather cool. But I thought we'd start this page. I jumped ahead a little bit and stuck her in and got the page prepped with matte medium. Let me trim her real quick. There we go. Okay. Yes. Yes, yes. All right. I hope you guys are doing really, really well. It's definitely full, right? <laughs> Got my Ugg boots on, my favorite sweater. Got my uh, cup of coffee. Cheers. Mm. I'm going on the coffee. Okay. I'm going to have to do a uh, catch up flip through, I think. I've been working here and there randomly in the books and trying to get as many videos put together as I can. But yeah, I don't know where I'm at anymore. I'm just doing it page by page today. Let's see, let's do this. And I think I want do that coming down here, cover that. Yeah, okay, this is in Peru before we get started. There are 26 period wow. Pyramids and mounds at Tucum. Is it Tucum? A 220 hectare or 540 acre site inhabited by the Sikan before being taken over by the Chimu and lastly occupied by the Incas. He built uh, mud brick monumental mounds as burial sites for the elite and places of worship. Okay, now we know. But will we remember? I don't know. Probably not. That's why I'm going to have to get a second book. And that way I'll have one to show you what it looked like before I messed up pages. <laughs> oh my goodness. Actually, I need to do that with the Abandoned Places and um, the Abandoned Rex book. Just have a second copy that's unadulterated. You know, as it were. Okay, if you are new here, I am currently using uh, Liquitex Matte Medium love it. I also use golden matte medium from time to time and I usually use apple barrel paints in the what is it? Matte acrylic um, and sometimes I splurge and get the um, what is that? Folk Art? Yeah. Which is also a matte finish acrylic paint because I can get them for reasonably cheap at the Walmart And since I have like zero budget, uh, yeah, they, that works for me. And it helps when it comes to doing these pages because you can um, draw over them with pencils and whatnot. And I also varnish pages when they're finished, but um, I'm taking a break from varnishing for a little while. Because I've noticed when I sit down to varnish a page, I get halfway through it and then I think of other things I could have done, <laughs> could have done or added to that page. And it's like, oh man. Of course, you could probably, since it's in a book, you could probably matte medium over that and add the rest of your stuff and then varnish it again. But that seems... Uh, a little bit superfluous, I guess. Okay. There we go. So 
So what projects are you guys working on? Let's see, this will go up, I'm hoping, October... Tenth or eleventh, maybe. Um, I think the tenth or so, ninth or tenth. I don't know. Um, yeah, what what fall projects are you guys working on, if any? Are you just like me, and seasons don't really matter, and you just do whatever? I was thinking about doing NaNoWriMo this year, but I don't know I'm going to be able to if I still want to do videos and school stuff. Which is okay. I, I do have a notebook. I'm writing down random ideas as they come to me for future writing, however. So I will take that as a win. Because I always mean to do that, and then I don't write stuff down, and then it's gone. I used to be really good at writing everything down, but... Then I had these weird books of random notes that I had to, you know, transcribe into the book that they belonged in, and it just became a pain in the tuchus. So I quit doing it. And then there's my sticky notes. Oh my god. I have a little bit of a habit of, of sticky notes. <laughs> A little bit of an addiction. I love them. But that also ends up being just, I have piles and piles of sticky notes from over the years that I'm still trying to weed through. Like, just random ideas and projects and stuff. And I'm behind on my Society of Idea Collectors stuff. And I can tell because, yes, yeah, so unorganized. It's ridiculous. I still haven't put my uh, Society of Idea Collectors binder together. If you're not familiar with the Society of Idea Collectors, uh, Dee Dee Willingham started this. Um, I, again, of course, because Dee Dee. <laughs> um, and it's a genius idea. Though I'm not very good at... Um, doing it consistently, you know, but I'll get there. I need to find new schedules for myself because I never stick to stuff, but if I can keep most of my day flexible and then do specific things in the evenings, I think I'll be all right. Although every time I try and do that, my sleep schedule jacks itself again, and yeah. Because right now, for the most part, I practice a polyphasic sleep cycle. Not an official one, though. But it's all good. I try and go with the flow. It tends to work better for me. And thankfully, I'm, I'm at a place in my life where I'm able to do that. Otherwise, I would be a complete nut job instead of mostly. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, I need to glue my thing back on. Don't you hate that? Poor thing. Okay. I don't know if there's something I could be painting out. Um, maybe. 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 Okay, no, what I'm going to do is let this dry, come back, and we'll do the next part. We'll flick stars on there and start working on this part. This is going to be a really simple page. For real. 
I have figured out how to simplify these pages. I will see you in a minute. Okay. We've got a couple damp spots, but we're going to work with it. Grab some white. One of these days I'm going to do like pink stars or blue stars or something. I don't know. Something. Okay. A little bit of water. And my flicky flicky brush, because I'm that technical. <laughs> flicky flicky. Let's see, is that thin enough? Maybe. Maybe. Try and not get it on my phone that's over there. That would suck. Wouldn't be the first time though. Actually I have um, varnish in the edge of my screen. And I'm just leaving it there because, yeah. Okay, I mean, little bitty, little bitty, little bitty ones. Little bitty ones. Okay. Alright, let's call that good for the moment. We're going to get our baby wipes because they are our friend. We love our friends, do we not? And because we have put matte medium down, this paint that we got flicked everywhere that we don't want it, as happens, um, will just come right off. Usually. You can do that if you don't matte medium your, your page. These pages are very, very glossy. Um, and if you're quick, it, it'll come off. I've had to do that a time or two. <laughs> I do prefer to matte medium my page first um, before putting paint down because when I do get to the varnish stage, I tend to scrub off a lot of stuff that was on my page somehow. I haven't quite got it down, but... I remember Dee Dee Willingham telling us at one point in time, she may have done it several times now, she says by the time you do a couple hundred of these, you'll, you'll kind of get it, you, you know. <laughs> and I've got three books now, and I feel like I'm starting to get a rhythm going, which is ridiculous because I've done a bunch of pages. Well, I haven't finished a bunch of pages, so... Maybe by the time I get all three books done, it'll be, I'll have it down. That was the goal this year, was to learn how to do this and, and not just learn how to do it, but get better at it. Um, yeah. But I really do want to use this black paint that's sitting over here off to the side. So what I'm going to do is move this over here. Hope it doesn't slide off. <clears throat> I'm gonna jump into abandoned racks real quick, find something that needs some black paint. I'll try it's doing stars. I'm gonna try and catch up on, on little ones. See that needs stars as well. That needs stars. I when we sit down and get pages, just finished pages, it the, it'll come together really, really quick. Um, or should do. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully it will. Um, I still have so much to map medium down. That's crazy. I still love this. This is my favorite bit here. Um, these little candies in the window of the train. <laughs> I love it. Um, no. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, hello, Jane Cop. No, so there you go. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. I know, you're such a love. 
Did you go outside? Did you? Yeah? Is it sunshiny and nice? Is it? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Where's your friend? Did he come back inside or no? Ow! Sir, no. Jay, too much. Too much. Gentle loves. <laughs> you cannot come up here to paint. That's not going to happen. Oh. Hi. Hi. All right, go find your chewy bone. Go find your bone. Where is it? Where's your bone? Go find it. You don't want it? No. <laughs> No, it's not playtime, sir. No, it's not. You go outside for playtime like that. <laughs> you're such a dork. I know, you're so beautiful. You cannot be in video. I love you. Thank you. Uh -uh. You lay down nice on the bed. sir. Jane. No. No, sir. To find something you're allowed to chew on. Okay. I'm going to try and get this done without being loved on by a 90-pound baby. He is such a love. But yeah, he's a big boy. A big boy. He hasn't filled out yet because he just turned one and being a big breed, it could take him a couple years. So we'll see how that goes. Mm. Okay, I'm not going for full coverage on this. I just want to get it started because we're going to add stuff to this. stuff peeking through, I am good with that. Although, if we still have paint, I may just black it all out anyway. I don't know. We'll wing it. Mm. Don't know what he's doing, that baby puppy. Okay, so I've got all three dogs bomb rushing the door, and yet I don't see anything. <sighs> On crack, I swear they are. Alright, calling that good for now. Set that aside, chuck that back in our water. Half time change books. doing. Okay, this is going to take a little while to dry because i got some great big ones. Mm. 
what are these are here? Mm, don't know. Alright, I'm going to let this dry. I'll come back and um, we'll start working the next part. Yes. Okay, got video going up on the YouTube. Now I want to make a mess, shall we? <laughs> For the moment, we're going to mostly finger paint because that's how I roll. You paint boogers. All right, let me uh, do this one here. Yeah, okay, there we go. Throw in some white. Blech. And my cobalt that I love. And yeah, I don't want to spend all day trying to make the color that I want. Alright, let's see. Let's start with something a little darker in the background. And I want some of that, and I want some of that. Because mm -hmm. I did that all out of order, didn't I? Yes, I did. Some of that one. Some of that one. first. Oh, that was an awful lot of paint, wasn't it? Okay. Throw some gray through that. Back up this way. Oh. Getting paint everywhere because that's what we do here. Who's on the move? It's Miss Sen. Hey, baby girl. What are you doing, honey? Poor old thing. She's 16 and just can't seem to get comfortable lately. The weather's cooled down, so her hips are like, no. It's like, I totally get it. Throw some more gray at this end, I think. Yeah. through that. Does it look like I know what I'm doing? Because <laughs> I don't. I am playing. That's what I'm doing and I love to play. Mm. Yes. a bit something, you know. 
show you that a little bit. Let's come back here a little bit. There we go. Uh, what I want to do is, hang on, because I'm going to come over her face some more. Throw a little bit of gray, a little bit of gray in that. There we go. Keep it simple. You don't have to use your fingers, use whatever. I like the more uh, hands-on, organic feel. <laughs> uh, sorry, I, I crack myself up, that's what I do. <laughs> but I do, I, I like the, uh, the more hands-on, textury bit. Oddly enough, I, I usually don't like like slimy things or whatever, but when it comes to paint and, and making something as we go, I, I don't know, I love it. Finger painting is amazing. And it makes my inner child happy, which is very important. Okay, now if I'm not careful, I'm just going to um, end up with mud. Or just one color. Okay, so I think I'm going to leave this here for the moment and we'll probably come back in with a little more white. Let's see what we've got left. Yeah, I like never put the right amount of paint down. That's crazy cool. Yay! There we go. Let's move that up there. Nice. Yeah, I think we're going to call it right there. And there's some spots you can still see the background through if you look real close, and I'm, I'm good with that. So we're going to walk away. Walk away. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, it's going to take a while. I don't know what else we're going to work on today. 
because um, actual, you know, it's been a while, but actual video time I don't think is that much yet. But this is going to take a while to dry and I've got to do, come in with these colours again and make rivulets of water. Ri rivulets, is that a word? Doesn't sound like a word today. Um, we got to do galaxy stuff and then, yeah, do, do water running down here into this. Um, and then, yeah, we'll add little details and stuff in the water and that'll be this page. But I don't know how much of that will get done today. I have a bunch of other pages. I Well, no, they're in this book. Dang it. Ah. I don't know. I'm going to go wash my hands and let this dry and then we'll just play from there. Right? Yes. Okay. Okay. Where did we get here? Hopefully that's dry enough. It's been about an hour and a half, I think. Not, not quite. Not quite an hour and a half. Mm, should be enough for us to play with a little bit. Little of that, and I'm going to use my fan brush, a very wet fan brush. And I just want to do a little more of this type of thing. Yeah, there's way too much paint in that. I think I'm good with that. I don't know if we want planets and stuff or what do we got? Hmm. I've got some planets. I don't know what I've done with them all. My table is such a mess. <laughs> Is 
are actually giant balloons, I guess. Those punch balloon things. This is thin paper. My scissors are like, no, I'm designed for heavy duty things. <laughs> Maybe a yellow one. water all over my jeans. That's what I get for putting pants on today, finally. <laughs> finally, seriously. <laughs> I've been lazy today. Actually, that's not true. I've done some chores today of all sorts. Got laundry going now. Trying to be responsible. Trying, being the optimal word there. Sponsatilities. It's something. all covered real well because we're going to paint on here mostly as well. Okay, this is one of our keep it really simple pages. It's a lot more drying than it is work with these pages, and it's like, well, that's boring. So I usually do these and then um, just chunk all the video together because, yeah, it's, it's a lot of dry time. I don't know if I want to come back in and do some more in here or not. You just let this be again. Let it dry, we'll come back and we'll do some work up here and then this stuff and I think that'll be it for this page. Uh, I could come back in and do more of this, I think I'll wait on that and if I get a wild hair I'll do that randomly. But I loved it. So far so good. Although this color still... something. Of course, I'm highly addicted to um, using this nail polish for water as well. So I might throw some of that in there at some point. Black and blue, it's called, is the color. It's by Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure. Black and blue, number 581. Found it at Walgreens. Um... Yeah. Actually, I should get into the Abandoned Places book and do the page I actually bought this one for. Because <laughs> I've used it everywhere else, but not in that book yet. I keep hoping if I, I ramble on long enough, this will dry miraculously and we can just jump straight in. But that's not happening, so <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, back again. It's been quite some time because they've been using chainsaws all in the neighborhood and oh my god. Like, don't they know I'm doing video? Like, for real? 
All right, what are we doing? We're playing. That's what we're doing. Um, Posca. Yeah. Do. Oh, Jane Cop, really? You have to wait till I'm shooting video. You're hilarious. No, sir. Yes, I know I love you too. Here you go. Up here. Up here. Oh, where have you been? Look at you. You're dirty. You got all dirty. You don't care, huh? You don't care. Okay, go ahead. No, no, I do love you. I do love you, but it's time to lay down. Okay. Oh my gosh. All the critters are crazy. Cray, cray. See, I want to do... Ow, dude! No. Down here. Thank you. Okay, let me try this again. <laughs> I had chainsaws going off in the neighborhood. We've had the dogs being whack, wackadoo crazy. All right, I want to do like this. I think to the, about the center, but I want to do. This one to there. I'm going to shoot out from behind that planet to the front of this one. Oh, that puts us. Well, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. That's fine. Well, yeah, it kind of does. Kind of does. That's all right. Actually, what I should have done was made that light name. Why did I not think of that before I started doodling? I don't know. <clears throat> okay. This one. This. This. Like that. Okay, totally messed this up now. Whatever. We're going to run with it. This one, let's see, this one I'm going to do in blue. And we're going to do like so. This to here to here. Like that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, a little bit like that. Random up here. Oh, 
because what we're going to do is use that as our beginning here. to hit every single one because I need to come back with the um, a lighter blue. Flying here again. Okay, I don't think that we need to do like every single one of these, right? I don't think so. But I do want enough to show what this is actually doing here. And I think I am gonna have to come back and, and do more layers in this. But for the moment, I'm going to call it, I think.
yeah, then we'll have to come in and do more, you know, the, the little pencil work and that kind of stuff. But I want to make sure this is really well dried and set first. Well, we should probably run some of that blue, right? Otherwise that's not going to make a whole lot of sense either. Maybe, I don't know. This has taken way too long for one page. <laughs> uh, there we go. And I cheated all that. I've let my camera run all day, so editing going to take quite some time on this one. That's okay. I didn't want to forget to turn it on because I've been doing that here lately. Okay, let me do that there. We're going to come in dark blue a little bit and do some of these as well. A little bit here and there. Today, at least, this one's just about done. All right, you guys. Yeah, I'll have to um, work something else into here, I think. But I love her. She's awesome. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out today. I love you. Thanks for being here. Okay, love you. Bye.